Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a fun unboxing for you guys. I finally got my first, which is technically my second, Play by Sephora box, and I'll have to explain it to you here in a second. But if you would like to see what I got in my December box, then please stick around. Okay, as I told you guys in the intro, this is my first box, technically second. My first box, I got off the waiting list in October, so I was going to get the November box. Um, I obviously signed up right away, put my inf credit card info, my debit card info in right away, and I was super excited. And then November came and everybody was getting their boxes. I was watching them all over YouTube and Instagram and mine was nowhere to be found. So around December 5th or so I called and they said that mine had been lost in shipping and I think this is not the first time it's happened to them. I've heard it's happened to several other people. So I was a little sad but they did credit me back the money that I spent and um, they got me all fixed up to get the December box so I have the December box and this is what it looks like it's super cute cute box packaging I mean it's just adorable and if you guys don't know already Sephora does have a beauty subscription box and I believe they're still kind of you know in trial period so uh, not a lot of people are able to get it yet there's a lot of people still on the waiting list I will have to put the um, uh, link below where you can sign up to get an email so that you can get off the waiting list. Um, I wasn't on the waiting list for that long. I would say probably a month maybe, which really isn't that long because I only missed out on two boxes. I would have gotten the November box, so I would have missed out on just two boxes. Um, so yeah, let's go ahead and see what's in this box. Now this subscription service comes with a little pamphlet in it and it comes with everything that's in your box and it explains how you can use it, um, you know, things like that. Really, really neat. And you can also go into any local Sephora and you can get a complimentary one-on-one -on -one learning session. It comes with a little card that you can take in there and they can, you know, teach you how to use the products or, you know, color match you for a certain foundation or whatever. Um, <clears throat> and you also get an extra 50 Beauty Insider points with any in-store purchase. So uh, that's a little bonus too. So that's an extra 50 points that you get. Um, oh, the subscription service is $10 a month um, and they do charge tax depending on where you live. Uh, there's a little bit of a tax charge for Texas, it's where I live, but it's not much. It doesn't even reach $11, so it's really not bad at all. So this box just arrived at my door today, seriously just today, and um, I was having some difficulties. I was going to film this makeup look and I started to, but I was just... It was not working out, so I gave up and just decided to film the unboxing of this instead. So I haven't peeked. This is the first time I'm seeing what's in here, so let's go ahead and see what's in here. So the first product in the box is a little sample size of the Make It Forever Aqua Eyes Waterproof Eyeliner Pencil. Um, like I said, it's a little sample size. Um, I haven't tried this. I've heard good things. So let's go ahead and give it a swatch. It's nice and pigmented and it glides on really easily, so that's nice. Um, I have so many black eyeliners, but these are always nice to have. So you can throw in your purse when you're on the go and you need to touch up. And the next product in this box is from Dr. Brandt, and this is the Pore Dermabrasion Pore Perfecting Exfoliator. Uh, this refines the appearance of pores, deep cleans pores, and smooth skin texture. I actually have a sample size of this, and I absolutely love it so, so much. Anything Dr. Brandt, I absolutely love. Um, I've tried their scrub, their microdermabrasion scrub. Oh, I absolutely love it. Their Pores No More Pore Refiner Primer. Love it. Um, they have a pore extractor mask. Absolutely love it. I mean, anything Dr. Brandt is super, super good. Really, really pricey, but it's really good. If you can get your hands on a sample, do because they are just amazing products. Now, um, I'm almost out of my pore dermabrasion uh, sample, so I'm glad that I have a backup because like I said, these items are really pricey. So anytime I can get my hands on a sample, I am all for it because I am not willing to spend like 
the money on these because they are so pricey but so so good and the next product is from smashbox this is the smashbox full exposure eyeshadow duo and these are in the shades s3 and m3 let's go ahead and open these such a cute little duo that's what the colors look like you get a matte shade and a looks like a metallic shade let's go ahead and give these a swatch that's what the eyeshadows look like. That's the metallic color, and this is the matte. Um, I had to build that color up a, uh, quite a bit because it is a kind a lighter shade, but it's a really pretty color, and that's absolutely stunning right there. Look, it almost looks wet. It's so pretty. And the next product in the box is from the brand Fresh, and this is a Seaberry Moisturizing Face Oil. 100% free moisture with... I'm sorry, 100% pure moisture with sea buckthorn oil. I have not tried any facial oils just because I am already pretty oily and I just, I don't know, the thought of putting more oil on my oily skin just kind of freaks me out. Uh, that's the little sample right there. It's so cute. Um, I don't know that I'll give this a try. I mean, I guess I could give it a try at night and not necessarily use this during the day. Um, it says it's a lightweight formula that blends nur nurturing sea buckthorn with other luxurious oils. Uh, I'll have to read up on this a little bit more and see exactly um, how it works. I'm a little scared to use it, but it's a nice, decent little sample. So, um, I mean, if I don't like it, I can always just pass it on to somebody else that has drier skin. But that's always nice, too. And the next sample is from the brand Nude Skincare, and this is the Advanced Renewal Age Defying Serum. And it comes with a little, like, foil, little circular foil pouches, and it comes with one, two, three, four, five, seven of them. So um, these will last a very long time because on the directions it says you apply two to three drops uh, to clean face morning and night. So one of these will last you one day so this will last you a week that's that's a nice little sample because usually within a week or so you should be able to tell if your skin's gonna like it or not um now whether or not you'll see any results you know that's not guaranteed but it's a nice little sample to try um i've never tried anything from this skincare line i've heard it's all right i haven't heard too much about it but i have heard it's pretty decent um so that's that and the last little product in the box is a perfume sample and i think this is added on as an extra because there's five um little samples and then this makes a six so i don't know if this is an extra if it's included as a um sample or not but this is the victor and rolf flower bomb perfume now i've heard of this perfume everywhere and i've actually never smelt it myself so let's go ahead and give it a whiff so let's go ahead and give this a spray i don't have anything on yet so the other day i was at ulta and i sprayed mark jacobs daisy this is so off track but oh, there we go um and like within 10 minutes of walking around the store, like my wrist started getting super itchy. By the time I got home, my wrist was so red and just kind of broken out and it was just itchy. I guess I had some sort of allergic reaction to Marc Jacobs Daisy, which is so weird. I've never had an allergic reaction to a perfume. So weird. Okay, this smells really good. It's kind of strong, but it smells so good. It's definitely nothing that I gravitate towards. Um, this is definitely more of a nighttime scent I, for me. Oh, it smells so good though. It smells so good. Now, I am very, my head hurts with certain scents, so I'm very picky with the perfumes that I purchase. Um, I have to really give them a test and really try them out and see if they'll work for me because Within 30 minutes, I'll have a headache, and it's just, it's ridiculous. But I really hope I like this one because, or like I hope my head, I don't get a headache because it smells so good. It's not too florally. I figured it was going to be super florally, and I do not like florally, I can't say that, florally perfumes. But this just smells good. It's a little, 
I wouldn't say musky, but it's a little bit more of a nighttime perfume. Oh, this smells so good, and I know it's expensive, but it smells so good. I'm going to have to see if I get a headache or not, because if I don't, I'm going to ask for this for... It's too late to ask for it for Christmas, but I might ask for it for Valentine's Day, because it smells so good. <laughs> So yeah, that's what was in my Play by Sephora box. This is really, really neat. I'm so glad that Sephora jumped into the beauty subscription box um, bandwagon because you get to try high-end products. So, And these are the products that you can find at Sephora. So if you like what you got in your box, you can go to Sephora, take your little card with you, try things out, and then buy things, and then you get an extra 50 Beauty Insider points. I really like this service. I'm glad that they came out with it, and you get to try higher-end items, whereas with Ipsy, you get a mix of, you know, like indie brands, higher-end stuff, and then kind of mid-range products, sometimes even drugstore stuff. Um, and Birchbox, you get more um, luxury products that are not so well known quite yet. Um, and you do get high end uh, products as well. But this, you get brands that are more well known, that are raved about, and you can get at Sephora, you know, you can get online or whatever, buy stuff, and it's just easier that way. This is just a great service, I think, that if you are wanting to get into a beauty subscriptions box, I would go ahead and try the Sephora box before I try Ipsy or Birch box, just because, you know, you get that um, more higher end products that you get to try out. And yeah, they're not always going to be, you know, the best boxes, but I have to say the December box is really, really good because I am going to use everything. The only thing that I may not use will probably be the face oil. I may only use that every once in a while, like if I'm pampering myself or something and I really feel like my skin is dehydrated, then I'll probably use it. But um, I'm kind of getting tired of Ipsy and Birchbox to be quite honest because I have so many samples laying around that I do not use. I have to hand out, pass these products out like crazy because they're just taking up space. And yeah, this, you know, I feel like I'll use these because I don't know, it's just to me this box is more exciting. I don't know if it's because it's new, um, but to me this box is a little bit more exciting. But that's it. This video has been way too too long than it should have been. So thank you guys so much for stopping by and watching this video. Like I said, I'll leave the link down below. This perfume smells so good. And I will talk to you guys next time. If you haven't subscribed already, please do. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.